choosing the right stud length. Once you've decided which woody stud is right for you, you need to determine what stud length is best for your snowmobile track. We've made this easy for you. You want the length of your stud to extrude a maximum of 3 eighths of an inch over the snowmobile track lug. Any longer than 3 eighths, you risk damaging the chassis, heat exchanger, or exhaust on your snowmobile. The key here is knowing exactly what your snowmobile track lug height is. To measure for lug height, measure just the lug. And the easiest way to determine lug height is to place a straight edge across two lugs and measure down from the bottom of the straight edge to the top of the track belting. Some tracks have lugs with varying heights, so use the tallest lugs for this measurement. This is your lug height. Now, once you have your lug height, check out our penetration recommendation chart. It's on our website under tech support. We've done all the calculations for you. If you have a stock track, or if you're replacing the track with one that has the same lug height, there's another option. Select your sled in our application guide. The appropriate stud length is listed on the recommendations page. You'll also be notified if tunnel protection is needed on your sled before studding. If you're installing an aftermarket track with a different lug height than the stock track, it'll be absolutely necessary to make sure you have adequate room between the new lug height plus the amount of stud over the lug to avoid damage to your snowmobile. If you have any questions about stud clearance on your snowmobile, please ask your local snowmobile dealer. Well, we hope this video has helped you. For more education about Woody's products, just visit woodystraction.com. Thanks for watching.